So I actually took a uh, USB to HDMI output from one output of my Mac. So I had another screen and that's where my timer goes. So I asked this question maybe a month, a month and a half ago. Um, so a prompter for a presenter, the audience will not see this. It's on, you know, downstage. And I wanted to have uh, notes and then a timer and be able to switch back and forth between a picture in picture timer or a full screen timer when they're doing a demonstration that needs to be timed. Um, and so a lot of suggestions, great suggestions, you know, use an ATEM mini to, to do the, the picture in picture. But I was trying to keep my kit as small as possible for travel. So I actually took a uh, USB to HDMI output from one output of my Mac. So I had another screen and that's where my timer goes. And then I took a simple HDMI to USB-C capture device that comes back into the Mac. And that is the live video for Keynote. So mm. you can see that I can put up my notes and I can have the picture in picture there. And you see that timer's going. I use a, a app uh, on timer and I can switch to a full screen timer so I can freely in the keynote determine what the looks that I want and, on, and I'm, I'm nudging the times on the countdown timers to make it end with the music so the chefs know to end their demonstration at the right time but it became a, a very simple yeah. kit just with those two cables to bring that back in. Yeah, I applaud you very ingenious use of existing hardware and software so not a new idea but uh, you did an ingenious way of achieving it with off-the-shelf art.